Good morning. So we left our campsite on Leonard Gorge River camp this morning. It was a nice camp, lots of space, very much in the wilderness and actually it's a very pleasant sleep. And uh, we're now at Windjana Gorge. And oh my gosh, I should see this. Look at the size of this. So we've got a bit here about the gorge and what we can expect to see. And lots of animals and snakes. All right, crocodile safety. Freshwater crocodiles inhabit this area. Just leave them alone. So if you, if you know anything about Windjana Gorge, this is where it's famous for seeing the crocodiles sunbathing on the sandy banks. These are freshwater crocodiles, so they won't normally hurt you unless you torment them. But look at these views. My. Stunning, isn't it? There we go, we're walking into the gorge. What a view. Look at that. So it's quite dry in the gorge. Look, you cut your cattle down here. Ooh, got to go through here. Ooh. And there we come out. Oh my. Oh, goodness me. How beautiful is this? Oh, it's very hot down here. Oh, look over there for the rocks, all those little cave bits. Oh, so <coughs> my hat's from not my bag again, making that crunchy sound. Hello. Thank you. Hello. It's only half eight in the morning. The road getting into Minjana Gorge. It's quite corrugated. We were still on the bitumen, as you call it, tarmac in the UK. And and um, as we're coming down, we were like, oh, 
I don't want to put our tires down if we don't want have to because I have to put them back up again when we get out just to go a little bit up the road but we ended up putting them down but well, we're not sure if we put them down low enough or not because it was quite corrugated Just look at the sheer size of this. Got a big boab tree up there. Morning. Morning. This is the end of the trail. What a beautiful trail. Yeah. Didn't feel like 1.5 kilometres. Which log? What, over the thing or here? Over the bank? There was something there. There's fish jumping out the water. There's all my sunbathing crocodiles. So they're saying they've seen a crocodile on the log over the other side or one of these logs? Oh, there's a there's a little oh, there's a baby there. There's a little freshy. That's not a fish, that's a baby. Freshy. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Fresh water crocodile. Look. And that is Windjana Gorge. There's a little baby. Oh, so we finished Windjana Gorge, wasn't it? Beautiful. We saw one little yeah, freshie. Right. See. I knew Blue was going to love it here. And you know the walks of the gorge. You know <laughs> he loves I don't like the commercial stuff. Oh, says he that loved the whales. <laughs> you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Anyway. He's on the beach and all that nonsense. So we're now doing the other walk. There's another walk at Windjana Gorge you can do called the... Savannah Trail. Savannah Trail. So we're just walking around there now. So it's just walking around the... It's a walk loop that goes sort of around the base. Yeah, come Along the gorge, we might get a bit of shade with a bit of luck. Yeah, I'm hoping. About 33 at 20 to 10 in the morning. 33 degrees, and it's 20 to 10 in the morning. It might be hot over. It was 32 when we got out of the car, and that was. Minutes, it's so hot, my eyes are actually sweating. <laughs> well, nice, though. Eh? I really well deserve a shower tonight. Whew. We can have a nice cold one at the back of our tent. Actually, we'll put your pump in that bucket of water on the van and we'll have our feature. 
That water helped with the cross on that one to get rid of. Oh yeah. Right. Right, a little bit about these termites here. Apparently, because I watch Naked and Afraid, if you burn that, it keeps the mosquitoes away. Also, I read if you rub it on your skin, it keeps the mosquitoes away. Some, something the termites have in them. Well, I'm not rubbing that on my skin. Uh, and I don't think you should. This, uh, look and also, you can take a lump, chuck it in the water, and it attracts fish, so you can go fishing. That's for me watching Naked in the Play. If he thinks I'm going to start collecting chunks of termite mounds for him, he's got another thing coming. I hope we might see a couple of snakes. Yeah. We haven't seen any snakes. Oh, when we were driving in on the very corrugated road, uh, there was loads of kangaroos crossing the road. That was cute. I didn't know hit any. They run before you get there. I couldn't go fast enough to hit anything. Right. It was very weird in the bottle shop yesterday. We had to fill in a tourist exemption because we were buying a case of beer and... Eight bottles of wine. And eight bottles of wine. And that's way above the limit allowed if you're a local. I found that very strange, but there you go. I asked him why. He said it was because there was an alcohol problem in the area. Not that he thought it solved anything, but... There you go. about an alcohol problem in the area? The problem in our van is we might run out. What's, what's this sign for? This tree... Oh. That's just about the, another holy <laughs> yeah. eucalyptus. There's a lot of eucalyptus around here. Oh, it made me jump. Oh, oh it just made me jump. A load of kangaroos just jumped out the bush. I don't think I caught them. But they're just down there staring at us. I just can't get over the size of it. It's absolutely huge. You'll see why people want to come down here. So let's look over the whole savannah. And in here, there will be hundreds of kangaroos resting until we disturb them. I haven't seen a single person walk this track. I don't know why, actually, it's very pretty. And you get to see this side of the gorge. Look at that bower tree. And I appreciate just the size of it. Isn't nature a wonderful thing? Yeah, we've done it. <clears throat> and that was the Savannah Walk, which is coming up to the car park now. So that's both yeah, walks. The shorter walk, but longer than the longer walk. Mm. So. We saw what we think is a skink kind of animal, but uh, I'm not sure what they're called. Uh, so we've done with Jammer Gorge, the main walk, and we've done the Savannah Walk. And yeah, Savannah Walk's very present actually, and you get to see all the kangaroos. So, maybe anyone's doing it. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen anyone talk about it, but yeah, it's quite bloody hot, don't we? And also, We've seen a couple of people here, but it's mainly tour buses, so they're just going to do the main sites, I guess. Anyway, let's see where we end up next. Hopefully, Tunnel Creek.
<sighs> I've got my bloody glasses on, it better not be too deep. Um, we are now at Tunnel Creek. Ooh. Oh, there's a few of them. Which, so you've got the tunnel yeah, view. Oh, that's the view. That's, a that's, view. A, we're, yeah, doing that's the, right, yeah. we're doing the subterranean trail. We've got our head torches ready. Mind you, we saw maybe those people aren't going in. They're just doing the the first trail bit. There's a lot of people going in with without torches and stuff. So. Absolutely filthy. Covered in dust. Look like I've got a tan, but it's not. It's red dust. There we go. Honestly, the history is quite shocking. Right. I'm assuming it's down here as there's no signs. down here. Deep water, falling rocks. Enter at your own risk. Okay. This way? Yeah. forward to this. Now I'm probably going to... <laughs> oh. Go down there somehow. Can you get that way? How does she get down there? <laughs> On the bottom I think. <laughs> I blew up a minute. Oh, yeah. Thank you. How do I get you to sit on just, the... Just sit on the rope and just fall down. Stand up to your knees. Right, so there. Put, yeah, there and then slide your bum onto that. I can't. That's it, and slide your bum up. <coughs> Got it? Sort of. <laughs> Ooh. Come on. Wow. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is. My God, it's pitch black in here. Um, Has he got to go to that light at the end, don't you? What light? There's a light down the corner at the end. Okay, Blue, can you please hold on to your t shirt when we go through? Because it's very dark. Don't be mean. I don't know if I'm going to go through yet. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. What well, about the old crockies? We won't see any, they never saw any. You've got to wash your bags in here, have you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Come then. Yeah. Well, we asked two people they said they only went up to waist height. Yeah. Um, so obviously I'll, 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 cool they are. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, she wasn't there. No. Come, let's do this. Well, where are we going? To that lake, aren't we? Mm. I'm holding on to blue for two. So what happens when we get to the end? Then it becomes light again. 
And then how do we get out? Back the same yeah, way? Yeah, same way. Oh. <laughs> What's your... Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, it's so dark in here. Oh Lord Jesus. You're telling me this crooked up. Oh, the light's only just there. Yeah, it's not far. <coughs> Ooh. Ooh. Okay, take two. Wait for me. I won't drag you down, but <coughs> I just want to hold on to you. Well, you're going to swim, so... Right, we're off again. We've, we found the... Look at these bubbles. Oh. <laughs> well, that bites well, doesn't it? These bubbles, that means it's a crocodile. Oh. Why is there bubbles there? Fish! Alright, you go with that. Okay. Oh, it's soft. Oh, it's nothing like that, the other bit. Wait for me! <laughs> Blues! I'm sinking! Oh, you've got to go. Don't mess around. Let's just do this. Right, get your bag, get bag, get in it, swim. Do not pull me under, otherwise there will be murders. <laughs> oh, this Ready? thing's crazy. Oh. Yeah, This is where we come out. Oh, there he is. Oh, look, there's loads of them. Thousands of them. I think they like us doing it. Is this the end? No, not yet. Too long. Why? Oh my god. Oh my god. He's <laughs> <laughs> making as much splash as possible <laughs> the crocodile fell away. <laughs> God, I can't believe it. We've just come from there. <sighs> We've made it to the end. because it's 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 terrifying <laughs> as awesome like did, at the same did, time did i know did, i know both i know uh, i really did want to swim it on my own i come yesterday to do this one because i didn't want to go swimming in caves in the dark with crocodiles. but are you glad you did it
spoiling got back. <laughs> <laughs> so we made it through Tunnel Creek now, we've just got to get back. <sighs> so we're gonna do the same journey back. Yep. Oh, so it was a busy day. We did uh Windjammer Gorge walk, Savannah walk at Windjammer. Um, then we did Tunnel Creek, which was truly terrifying. Um, very scary. Um, and I, I will put clips up of it here, but I'm also going to put up the full video um, if you're interested in watching it, so you can see the whole experience of walking down Tunnel Creek and um, how girly me and my brother were. <laughs> Anyhow, after that we drove back and we are originally going to go back onto the main road and find a camp there but we decided to stay at Windjana Gorge because it's a nice camp look you've got Windjana Gorge up there in the background there's loads of space here it's got showers toilets and uh, wi-fi but wi-fi doesn't actually work here on the campsite <sighs> Oh, I give up with the Wi-Fi. All I want to do is load my videos for you and it's just not happening. Um, then we've just been chilling. I had a shower when we got back. Oh, that was nice to have a shower here because it's oh, so hot here. It's about 40 degrees at lunchtime. Um, and then we've just been chilling by the van. Have an early night. Tomorrow morning we will set off. Um, head for Bell Gorge on the Gibb River Road see how we do there, run for time, see if we can fit another couple in before we move on up to Manning Gorge, um, which is part of Mount Barnett Station. We will camp at Mount Barnett and do Manning Gorge the day after and then move on up again. So, that, oh, the heat just takes it out of you. Um, it's not humid here, it's a very dry heat and so in Broome it was really, really humid and it was very difficult to sleep. But last night I did get a good night's sleep because it was hot, but it wasn't sticky, sticky hot. And actually I had to put my sheet on me about four o'clock in the morning because it started to get a bit chilly. So I'm hoping we get another good night's sleep. Uh, so this is Windjana Gorge. A few flies around. Um, it's just so peaceful. I just love it being so quiet. Just hear the birds, just hear nature. And this, I really you? like this. You okay. I will uh, catch up with you tomorrow. So thank you for watching today. So I hope you enjoy the gorge walks. And uh, if you want to see the full Windjana Gorge, I will be putting that up separate. Not the wind channel, the tunnel creek, the scary one. Um, I'll put that up for you. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.